Hey beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, it is going to be on Sephora 4th of July sales. So I picked a few stuff and if you would like to see what I picked, then stay tuned. So um, I, when I placed the order, uh, they were having 50% for a 4th of July sale on a website, on uh, Sephora's website. So I went to browse around, I picked and I saw a bunch of stuff that there, there were on sale and something that I was actually wanting to get. Um, so I was kind of excited to pick them up while I was actually um, shopping for the 50%, I just went ahead and bought a bunch of other stuff. A few things I just uh, was wondering and curious, so I picked it up. The first item I have here is my son is going to give it to me. Here you go, Mama. Thank you, Baba. So uh, this one right here from um, Norvina palette. And I wasn't actually excited to get this palette when they were not on sale. Uh, but when I saw they were at like 50%, this particular palette, I was kind of drawn to it because of the color. So let me go ahead and show you. I don't know which uh, number is this. Okay, so it's a volume three. Um, I also have a volume four that is coming. Uh, on Sephora's order. You guys probably have seen it, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you. And so again, the packaging, just the, just like the box, and this is what it looks like if I can open it. Ooh, okay, so there's the shield, and this is what it looks like. It's really gorgeous and beautiful colors. I love all the colors right here. Pretty like vibrant and out of my comfort zone, but you can actually create a neutral colors as you desire. Basically, you can do uh, colorful looks and you can do uh, like natural, neutral look. So after I picked this one up uh, or placed the order, um, I went back to see like if there anything else they added in new. This palette, specifically this palette sold out. So really nice. I'm very excited for this neon green right here. I don't know when I'm gonna create a look with the neon, but. I should pretty soon. So yeah, this is the first palette. Okay, so the next palette I have here, um, I I actually it is a repurchase, but I went ahead and used it a few times uh, now. So it has an imprint and all that. So can I have the palette, baby? Here you go, mama. Thank you. Here's the palette right here. And this is from Tarte Pro Glow. Basically like a highlight, blush, and bronzer together. Um, these. This has a little bit of smell, not that much, but I actually do like all the colors that they offer here. And this is really a nice and, you know, travel um, kind of a palette. Although we are not traveling anywhere, but if you are, if we are ever, you know, which we probably will, hopefully this virus goes away quick. But uh, when we get to trouble, I probably will take this with me. That way I have a couple of blushes, although they're kind of similar tone, but I do like to mix them together. And then I have one like a darker, a little bit of bronzy looking highlighter. And this one is more like a, a pink kind of a highlighter. This one is really nice for uh, bronzing and contouring, uh, more so bronzing than contouring. And this one is for more bronzy with the shimmery look for a summertime. So, and I really like it. So the next palette, also a repurchase. Go ahead and show you the palette. Can I have it please? Here you go, mama. Thank you. You're welcome. So this is the palette right here. This, I used to have it and I decluttered it and I did use this as well with the other palette that I showed you. So this is what it looks like. This is really nice and has all the colors like neutral type of colors. Um, this, you can create so many smoky looks and for fall season, it's perfect, you know. These colors are perfect for a fall season. I'm sure some of you guys probably have this palette and adore it. I repurchased it because I was kind of like, oh, I forgot about this palette, you know. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick it up and it's it was 50% off, so. Oh, the next thing I have here is this one right here and this is the Becca First Light Primer Filter right here. So this is what I got. Um, I used to own this one. I think I decluttered it also. Actually sure how it was and all that, so I'm gonna, I'm excited to reuse it. And um, please excuse the noise because the neighbor next door is mowing their grass. So the noise is always there. No matter when, what day I try to film, it's someone is always mowing their grasses. So the noise is always there. So. Anybody else want to make noise? Uh, okay, yeah. I'll go ahead and add you on my video. You want to make more noises? 
So anyway, the next product I have here is this one, and this is also from Becca Shimmering Skin per Perfector Liquid Highlighter right here in Precycle Pop right here. This wasn't on sale, but I picked it up along with that one because it had a on my recommendation, um, you know, if I would like to pick it up. So I went ahead and picked that one up because I do like to use them as under my um, foundation or like over my foundation. This one uh, is really nice color. This is the one right here, really beautiful. I'll try to stick with the glow product, I guess. So the glow product I would like to mention here is from uh, Mac Daddy, that's uh, his uh, collection right here. And it's from Artist Couture. And I got the Coco Bling right here. This one was not on sale. I'm not sure which one was on sale, but I picked three of these. Citrine right here. And this one is a Coco Bling. bling and this one is Luminati or Luminati, something like that. So I'm going to give you, show you guys a swatch for these all three colors. So this is Luminati, this is Coco Bling, and this one is Citrine. Very beautiful highlighters. So the next item I have here, I uh, picked up from uh, uh, Natasha Denona and this one right here this is the super glow Natasha Denona's uh, highlighter palette in fair right here I got this one and then also uh, since I was there and picking it up I picked this one up I don't think this was on sale but I got the uh, all over face plus body shimmer powder in what is the shade right here oh uh, shade medium right here so this is what it looks like so this is the light fair and light on super glow and this one is the uh, glow and body and face shimmer and this is what it looks like right there that's the darker color which is a face and body this one is a fair light so the next thing i it is like my backup purchase um this one right here is a mark jacob glow stick in a spotlight right here and i do use that i have one that's in my vanity right here um, and this one right here is Invisible number 32, undercover, basically, it's like the eye primer, but I like to use them under my eye. Uh, it prevents you from creasing and stuff like that. Today, I don't have makeup on. Usually what I do is I put this under and then I'll go with the corrector and then concealer. That way it doesn't, I think it doesn't crease under my eye. That's the reason I like to use that for. And this is the container or the component looks like and that's the color i'm not gonna mess with this one because i already have one that i use and you probably have seen me using that on my luxury uh, item that i when i use for my face and stuff and the next item i have here is the tan honey that's my color from tarte and this is the Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation, although I don't like to wear full coverage, but you can always just take a little bit and mix it with your uh, moisturizer and dilute it a little bit. This is a waterproof, so I thought, you know, let me go ahead and try this and see how I would like it so that way it's uh you know the foundation doesn't melt away from my face right. so the next product i have here is from lancome this type of eyeliner Gren grandos uh liner i'm probably butchering it but this is the liner in black fill tip liner excited to use this so next item i have here is fenty beauties matchstick i got the chill mango color right here and see how I like it because I do like the color. So the next item I have here is from Tarte and this one is the little one. I broke it because I dropped it and it just cracked all over the place. This one is an exposed highlighter right here and this is what it looks like. This is the one right here. It's really beaming and nice highlighter but you can always soften it with the beauty blender or brushes as you go. So the next item I have here is these items right here. They're from Ciate London. And these are the lip lipstick. And once it a little bit dries on your lips, you just like this and it brings out like the shimmery color. These were on sale for $9.99, used to be $20. And I know back in like two years ago, I had a couple of them I purchased um, uh, for my mom and she loves it. In color Forbidden and the other one is uh, Fortune and uh, Hollywood. 
So basically, if you can keep it as matte or you can, when you uh, put your lips together and rub it, the glitter comes uh, out. Very last and not least item is from Natasha Denona. I repurchased this one and this one is color Sienna and I was actually really like this color. I don't know what happened to my uh, other one. I guess I lost it or whatever happened. But this one is really beautiful with like a very neutral eyeshadow. That on top of it, if you put that on, it's like really nice color. I just put my stuff in an awkward position to show you guys. But so yeah, this is what it looks like. That's all I have for this 50% uh, sell item. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take off today and I'll catch you on my next video. Hopefully you guys uh, enjoy this video. Take care, bye now.